Hello everybody and welcome to The Legend of Bumbo. In the previous episode, we unlocked and played Bumbo the Dead, and he is... he's pretty difficult. He's pretty difficult as a character. We're gonna give him another go. Basically, his starting items are really good, but they switch over their mana cost every time, so it's really hard to reliably be able to use things. You just have to collect a lot of all of the manas. Um, but... He, his little fly thing that does one damage per turn whenever you, wherever you place it to that row is very, very effective at taking out certain enemies. So he is actually pretty good. He has a decent um, a decent sort of moveset to him. The only problem is he only gets one move per turn, as you guys saw in the previous episode, those of you that watched. Um, and that makes him very, very inflexible with, um, with what he can actually do, especially what he can do on the first turn. So... The first thing I'm going to do here is that, and then do move down one, move down one. We get a burn there straight away. Take one of these out. The good thing is, though, he does deal he does deal two damage with every puzzle, which is very, very nice. Um, it's not often that a lot of people do... Well, I don't think any of the others deal two puzzle damage on a normal turn. Uh, we can actually do this as well. Move right one. Did I do that wrong? I think I did. Move right one. Move right one. There you go. And we've got a tooth there. So then we can throw that there. Deal two damage. And then we can place a fly here. And that'll just deal one damage per turn. Which is obviously rather nice. Um, is there anything else we can do? Anything at all? I'm not seeing anything so far. We can try for this. But I don't think it's going to let us do it. I don't think we're going to have enough mana. Oh no, we are. We are. We've got two moves. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, what can we do with those two moves is the question. Is there anything we can do with those two moves? We may have just... Oh, no, we can, we can. Let's let's build up that. Get some more mana there. Throw that at you. Put that on there. And then throw another one of those on you. And I think that's, I think that's, that's, that's our lot there, isn't it? I'll send our turn there. This guy should take another one damage. There you go. Uh, unfortunately, you can't stack those, so it's not as easy as that. So let's just do that there. Then get another fly going. And there you go. So honestly, uh, I also forgot to say he does start with only soul hearts as well, which makes him even more difficult. He has a lot of negatives. Uh, I don't think that works for us, so let's just go with a mallet. Um... But yeah, we, we kind of want as much board manipulation as we can possibly get, really. I think that's how we're gonna how we're gonna win with this guy. So usually what I tend to do is try and build towards this straight away. Uh, so if we can build tooth, that'd be perfect. Can we build tooth? Um We can. If we do that there, and then we move that one to the right, one to the right, one to the right, and one to the right. Used a lot of mana there, but it's worth it. So then I'll take out that guy there. And then we'll set up this in the middle row, which will kill that guy. And also deal damage to these two next time. It only deals damage to the f uh, the frontmost enemy. It can't deal um, damage to multiple enemies at once, I don't believe. And um, we can move that down one as well to get that going. Um, because it is two damage, I'm just going to hit that guy. These guys are bigger threats. They have more HP. Um, we've got move down and move across. Damn, if only we could move left. If we move left, we could do a really good poop play there. Uh, I will I will do this, though. I will get a, a nice bugger player going on here. I didn't mean to do that, but it's fine. Don't, honestly, I, I only wanted it for the mana, so I'm not that bothered. We could do, we could try to do this. It might be a bit expensive, but... Ah, uh, damn it. Didn't quite get enough mana there. It's fine, though. It's fine. So we've got two attackees. One of them's in the back line there, um, so that's not great. We'll go for the poop player there, just to set up a poop to stop that guy from hitting us. Um, then, we do have the split into two, which is useful, although very expensive. Um, we don't have a move there available. We just have the move right available here. So, let's try to do a move right, move right. Wait, is that something wrong there? Oh, that, no, that, I was like, I'm, I'm trying to get a burn play. I'm not. I'm trying to get a move. There you go. Uh... Now, we got a fly damage, so we might as well do that on here. Get that guy done. But where's the play here? Where's the play? So, I reckon for now we move that right one. And then we, we end our... Oh, no, we, we, we've got a move. Let's just do that. There you go. I was going to end our turn, but we don't need to. 
So we can throw one at that guy, and throw a second at this guy, and he's almost dead now. And in fact, when we end our turn, he'll actually die. Unfortunately, he does get to take his move first, but still. And uh, now, with this, we can just play that there. Get a very big burn play going on for four damage, and kill that guy. This is going extraordinarily well compared to last time. Last time we were having quite a lot of trouble with this character and finding him quite difficult to play, but this time around, I'm having a good time with him. I'm finding him a little a little more um, easy to understand. So I'm going to go for a bugger play straight away, which may seem a little silly, but it's basically it's just so I can access this fly thing here. It means I kill one enemy and get the next like lot of them, the next row sort of dealt with early on. Uh, another thing we can try and do here is we can try and get ourselves another move, and we did manage that, very nice. And then with that, we can make a burn play, which gives us yet another fly. So I'm gonna take my damage and put it on this guy here. Uh, and then set up another fly here. So then these two side rows are uh, pretty much dealt with now, uh, in terms of using our, our fly effect there. We can still use it for an extra one damage every turn, but it's not gonna stack. And then... I'm going to try for a bit of a weird play here. It might cost a lot, so I don't know if it'll work. But, nah, unfortunately it didn't. We got the wrong mana there. But we almost got it. We can do it in the next turn. There you go. Them two are dead. Move that down there. This is going to deal two damage. So I might as well just go with that guy. And then this time... This is this is where we could be taking some serious damage here. Uh, let's try and think about this logically. Especially considering our mana is, is all out of whack here. I don't... I don't like the fact that we don't have burn mana right now. Is there any possible way we could make burn mana? I don't think there is, unfortunately. Um, it really doesn't look likely with only being able to move right. In fact, we can't really do anything with only being able to move right here. Oh, no, we can we can make a poop play. We can make a poop play. So we can at least deal with one of these attacks, which is very nice. Um, and then... We... Could nah, damn it. Um, this is going to be well expensive, and there's a really big chance this doesn't work. But I'm going to try it out. Come on, don't cost tooth, not tooth burn. You damn bastard! We're so close. We can do this though. That that actually makes a burn play there. We can take that guy out and kill him. There you go. We've actually that was that was a really good bit of problem solving there. That worked quite well. Um, and then if we can make just one attack here, we're pretty set on this guy. To be fair, if we can make one bugger, we're fine. So if I go like, we've only got move down available now. It's, it's a tragedy. Our, our, our mana is like just terrible right now. Um. Trying to look at the attacks that we can make here, but there just there isn't much going on, is there? There really isn't. I can't make a bugger play, really. What the fuck do I do here? Let's let's just set up for next turn then. So let's just go throw here and yeah, let's just end turn. Manager in. Wow, that's terrible on this character. Not that it matters too much for us right now, but it is generally quite terrible. But there you go. He's dead. Played decently well there. Uh, going to Iron Room, please give us something outstanding. I think we have to go with that, you know? Like, it's expensive as hell, but I think if we don't go with that, we're going to be really struggling for moves if we don't get, like, one on the move wheel, which I'm pretty sure you can't even get. Like, I, I swear I remember when we went to the uh, move wheel, like, the, the little slot machine wheel thing. It didn't have any moves on it. Like, you just couldn't get extra moves, which is a real horrible move. So... The the board here is awful. I'll 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 state it plain and simple. The board here is not good. We don't really have anything on there that's gonna aid us. We can't make any combos in one move. It's just all round a bag of shit. Uh, so let's just do this for now, and try and move this over here. There you go. That that at least clears some stuff off the board. Uh. Then, let's try for a big old play. Oh, that's that's actually unexpected, but I'll take it. Um, also, we'll deal the fly damage here. But let's try for a big old play here. 
Give me the play. Give me the play. The only thing is we're spending so much mana. It's going to be so hard to get this ever. Wow. You are... You are getting absolutely shrekt, my dude. Absolutely shrekt. If I split that, this, will it split to the other side? If it will, that's kind of worth it. Uh, I think, I think though, what we do is, I don't know why I did that, cancel that. I think we split that, and then we try and move this over. There you go, look at that. That's pretty, that's pretty good thinking, that is. I like the splitting things. It allows you to not only create more of a certain tile, it really helps you out. Uh, we don't have enough mana to make this work. We do have a move, though, so let's do that. Wow, that was a big one, that was. Got poop, poop, and then we've killed him? No, not quite. Actually, yeah, we have. With our fly buddy, I think we killed him. Damn you. Damn you. Um. Hmm. Is there an easy move we can make here? I'm going to go with a risky play here. Move down. Move down. Okay, that gave us plus one move by accident. Fair enough. That works, I guess. Right, there you go. We have done really, really well so far with this guy. Much, much better than the last run. The last run seemed to, like, go on forever and just we kept getting shafted. But this time's going a lot better. More white tiles. Attack with curse. We just I'm just going to go with more white tiles. More damage is better for my, for, for my liking. Um... So yeah, as you can see, there's no move on there. I would love puzzle damage, though. Puzzle damage would be really, really good. Okay, our 20 cent would be good, too, because that gives us a 3 sculpt Monty player and another play on this thing. I, I seem to get the 20 cent one all the time. I'm so lucky with it. Please give me the... Oh my god, it's insane. I don't get it. How do I get so lucky? If you get that three times in a row, you get to play the wheel twice. It's so good. Actually, we can already play the wheel twice. Oh my god. <laughs> this this must be like a bug or something. This has happened to me three different on three separate separate runs now where I've got the 20 over and over and over again. All right. I'm going to go for another puzzle damage. Please give me another puzzle damage. That'd be so good. We got luck. Fuck luck. I don't know what it does. Seems worthless. Right, let's go do a th three skull Monty player. More coin rewards. Sounds decent. Could help us out in future shops. Cool. I'm happy with that. Want to drink it. So when we come into future shops, we're going to have a little bit more money on us. But so far, things are going very, very well. Um, getting that extra puzzle damage is imperative to our survival. Considering now, we've got more burn players. And we're going to be able to use them more often. That It's just going to be like insane. We're going to be able three damage a burn as well. So as you can see there, one-shotting enemies like that, it's beautiful. It's just, it's just beautiful. Right. Is there much else we can do here? Is there much else we can do here? I mean, I can try this. It's a bit of a, a bit of a lengthy play, to be honest. But it works. It works. Do you know what? It actually fucking worked. Um. Now, considering we got the more burn mana, we're not getting much burn mana here. Uh, so I'll move that across there, and then try and move that right twice. There you go. Let me get another kill on turn one. It's lovely. Uh, then we can try for yet another one, and we get it. Wow. Three kills turn one. Very, very good. Uh, do we have any move rights that we can do? I don't think we do. Let's just end our turn there. Right. Let's make a poop, shall we? Make a poop. What? Uh, uh, no. Uh, no. Excuse me. Oh, God. Everything costs bugger. Everything costs bugger. That's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. Uh, I've not had that before, where everything costs the same. Damn, I screwed myself there a bit. That was that was bad on my behalf there. Very bad on my behalf. Let's just set up for a bugger play then. We're gonna have to. There 
There you go. I'm going to deal damage to that poop there as well. Actually kill it, which is nice. Nice, let's deal that to that guy. And... I'll just deal that again. And then end, uh, end turn, he'll die. There you go. Okay, we lost half a heart there. Which is a bit upsetting, but not bad. Whoa, more coin rewards. We got three. Yes. Um, enemies move slower. Let's go with enemies move slower. I don't know how exactly that works, but I'm happy with it. Uh, so if we could get damage right off the bat here, that'd be lovely. Um, I think if we do that and then do double move down on that, that's going to give us two kills. Right off the bat. Oh, it's going to give us almost two kills. We can't, we can't throw through that poop thing. Then we'll go there. Wait, if that damages him and hurts me, I'm real pissed off. Gonna move that across one. That down two. Yeah, I don't know how that's gonna work, but it seems like it's gonna be horrible. It seems like I might get hurt for no reason here. I can't do anything here. Uh, I've got two moves, so I, I don't really know what to do with them. Because I'm going to get hurt if I hit those those stupid fucking things. Uh, can I set up any poops? Let's set up a poop here. Is there any more poops I can set up? I don't think there is. Let's just end turn. Okay, it, sh it goes right through them. But now there's fucking shit everywhere. It's horrible. Excuse me? What? Okay, it, apparently it does it does just fucking go through that. God damn it, that's terrible. That's that that should not be like that in my opinion. That should not be like that. That's really bad. That's really bad. Because there's nothing to stop like I once I've set this up I can it's in motion. I can't do anything about it. I don't think it's fair that I could accidentally hit that cloud. Like, I'm going to hit the cloud here. Um, there's nothing I can do about it. I'm pretty sure if I throw this through the cloud, it'll hurt me too. Like, it's going to hit me now, isn't it? I don't know what to do here. I think we're a bit stuck. I'm going to do that and turn. But now the, the cloud's going to attack me. Isn't it? Isn't it? Unless it just felt like it last time. Maybe it just felt like it. I'm not, I'm not happy about that at all. Nope. Nope, it's not going to attack me. Doesn't feel like it this time around. Okay. What? What did I get hit by that time? What the fuck is going on here? Okay, this this is this is schwacked. This is this is schwacked. Something's broken. I really don't like the fart cloud attack. It's pissing me off. Move right. Move right. Guess we'll just have to end it there. Give me all the moves. Right. Uh, let's set up a poop player. Right here. Should have probably set up there. Oh well. Uh, so it's got two. It's got two counters on it. Damn. That was stupid. Move down one. Move down one. We are so dead here. We are so dead here. Bonk you down. Now the poop's worthless. Noise. In turn. We're dead. There was never a way we were going to get away with that one. Sad times and things. Very sad. Ugh. I, I, 
I messed up really bad when the fart clouds came up. I didn't know what to do against them. They're difficult. Uh, I'm not. I'm not really sure what you guys want with the uh, the future of this series. Um, you'll have to let me know in the comments whether you want me to keep playing this till I try and like unlock everything and all the characters, or if you want to make me switch over to another game. It's it's, it's really up to you guys. Um, I I know that the feedback on this game has been pretty positive so far, but I really would like to hear from you guys and what we should do with this series going forward. Either way, I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.